it's hello from Stirling about Fourth Bank Stadium. It's a lowly league. The University of Stirling versus Civil Service Stores. And I'm just in the ground. Uh, it was just something that uh, I said, I'm in the ground. Eh? What I wanted to point out is uh, it's one of the few grounds that have got the proper dugouts, you know, actually dug out into the um, where they get the name from. Very good. And I'm here with Craig, another famous stroller fan. <laughs> so, so what do you think of the, this game? It all depends on what Stroller's team turns up because University of Stirling have been you know, won the last three games. Yeah, yeah, I think it'll be quite an interesting one tonight. Uh, I think obviously Stroller's come off the back of the win against Gala, being high spirits. Um, you know, Stirling Uni have been on really good form lately. Yeah. They've been on a good run, so uh, I think it could be quite an interesting one. I think it'll be a fairly close game. Um, but yeah, hopefully the goals and uh, plenty of action. Eh? Yeah, good stuff. You never had a very good start of the season, but would you agree that you've got it together now? You've got the players, Aye. you've got the squad. Yeah. You got a few boys back from injury, a few boys scoring goals now. Um, obviously, just like a lot of teams in the league. Um, Cali Braves, etc. The same. Lost a lot of players. Takes some time to get the new squad up and running. I think it's um, we we got beat off Celtic and then we drew with Albion Rovers as well and then we had East Stirling before that. So it's been actually quite a good run in that regard. Um, but I think I've said to you before, like any win in the Lone League is a hard win and it's going to be tough tonight because they're coming off a good win against Gala. So yeah. it's a good opportunity for some of our guys tonight with a different team we've got out. So we'll see how it goes. Thanks, what so Stephen Have you got uh, all the players back? No, we're still missing a few, but um, I think that we've gone on a wee bad run there, four defeats, and to get a win on Saturday gives the boys a boost. Um, and it's now trying to get back to back wins, and that's it's not going to be easy coming out of Stirling, who are no. bang on form, so we need to give our best shot, and if anything, up the levels for Saturday. Well, that's the team's out. I think that's the first time I've not seen University of Stirling in green. They're always in green. That's our away tips are purple, and Solars are in there. Oh, we took their all red. And it's a stroller to kick off. Oh, oh, Well, it's a corner there, first corner of the game, uh, Uni. Oh, shot there, deflection. 
and it's going for a corner. I'm going to say throwing in the front corner. Oh, you know, close one. Oh. Oh. First corner of the game. One not all the strollers, but the university had the, what would be five corners, the strollers won? Yeah, it's, it's been a, to be fair, it's been a pretty good first half. I think both teams have played really good football. Um, Stirling looked dangerous on the break. They do seem to get up the pitch pretty quickly with very few passes, but I think the strollers have looked better in the final third. The, create, the creativity has been brilliant yeah. so far from the strollers. And, uh, you know, Finlay took his goal well, top yeah. corner. Uh, Lawson had the chance. Yeah. It was a good save, but you know it was close. Uh, great, great play by Girdwood to get the ball in. So it's you know Stores could be two or three nil up, but you know fair play to Sterling. They've defended well when they've needed to, and the game's still very much open. So it should be a good one in the second half. Yeah, there's been a lot of good football being played. Uh, not as many goal moves there. Interesting, maybe as you'd expect, but a lot yeah. of good football. Eh? It's been good, good passing from both sides. Eh? So it's certainly uh, been a, a pretty good game so far. I think the second half will probably be a bit more of the same. Yeah. Hey, I'm Charlie. I'm Ryan. What do you think of the first half then, guys? Good so far. Good quality. Got the ball through. Right. <laughs> I think we're quite right. I thought it was actually quite. First time actually coming to a lonely game for the quality, I didn't right. expect the quality to be that good. I, civil right. service has been really quite good. The, the goal was stunning. Eh? That was a good goal. Uh, it was a good it's been good football, eh? It's been enjoyable uh, to watch. Yeah. yeah. Definitely. Definitely been good. So this is your first lone league game? Uh... Aye. 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 It's my first lone league game. It's my first time here actually as well. Right. Do you, you go around different grounds or are you just... No, I just, just, just fancied it really. That was, just, that was it really. Kenny was local, Kenny was at Fourth Bank. We thought, aye, we'll right, go watch it. Oh, good. Oh, good to speak to you guys. <laughs> All right. Yes, kick off there. I was speaking to a few people. Just missed a kick off, second half. Underway. Oh, I know. Oh. 
Chance here. Oh, there's a chance here. Oh, there's a chance here. 
So fair play to Sybil, um, played very well and uh, yeah, uh, put us under a good bit of pressure in the first half uh, especially but uh, and took the chances to be fair. Sybil took the chances and it's probably a game of Sybil taking the chances and us not. Um, at 1-0 down we had three great chances um, to, uh, to be honest with you, take the lead even worst case equalise. So, um, and then they went up the park probably what, three, four minutes later and, yeah. and, and finished the game 2-0, 2-0 yeah. game over with, with 10 minutes, 15 yeah, minutes. It was nothing starting to the better team, but it is a very scored goal. And you had a lot of corners as well, but they managed to defend the yeah. corners as well, you know? Yeah, they're, 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 a good, they're a good team, big strong team as well. And we obviously, two games on one day, we had to change it up. Um, we had to change it up quite a lot in terms of our team, so yeah. we gave opportunity to some boys that uh, haven't played in the first team yet, and uh, some twenties boys who did really well, to be honest with you. Yeah. So, um, so great, great experience for them. Um, but yeah, it's a sore one. It's a sore one. We yeah. Actually, um, I think especially the second half, we we dominated. Um, yeah. Had the better chances in the second half. But and, yeah, that's that's. that's and there was football. some good football as well. Yeah. You know, even though you got beat, yeah. there, there, there was we played some good football. So. Just, just we, yeah, we didn't take our chances, and we didn't create many, too many clear cut chances. To be fair, but. Um, of the chances we, we did have, we should have taken. Thank you very much, John. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah. Right, Craig, a 2 0 win for the Strollers. What did you think of the game then? Yeah, it was a, a very you know, entertaining game overall. First half was good, second half was was decent. I thought I thought Sterling Uni were pro probably the better side in the second half. We get the possession, but I thought, again, Strollers were more clinical in front of yeah. goal. It was notably a young Sterling Uni side. Yeah. A lot, predominantly 20s players that were playing the night, but that doesn't matter. I thought the Strollers were outstanding. Yeah, they and, defended uh, well, eh? They defended aye, well. The, the second goal killed it. Yeah. I think that, that kind of put the game to bed, but, you know, both teams put on a good show tonight, so it was certainly an enjoyable watch. Certainly was. It was. It was a lot of good football on display, both sides. Definitely, yeah. We're well worth seeing it under the lights. Definitely. Thank you, thank you. A good result tonight. You'll not just be happy with scoring the two goals, but good defending as well. Um, I thought the first half were were good. Um, the, the same half, it was a bit of seat of pants pants stuff, to be honest. I think um, we can do better than that. And I think that, um, the players know that, but he showed a bit of everything, a bit, a bit dissolve. Bit quality at times um, in the first half, especially. And um, the young goalie coming in did fantastic for us a couple of great yeah. saves. So I think we, we rode our luck, but um, not a lot of teams come away with three points here.
half of the amount the defenders were always like, they had to be five or six corners in the first half, and you, you managed to defend those corners well. So they did, they've got great, listen, they've got great delivery, they've got good players, you know, I think that they obviously had to mix their sides up, and um, the young boys that came in from them were fantastic. Um, but no, we did defend well, but uh, um, and uh, I think the clean sheet they can take. Um, a lot of heart for that. We've been looking at the clean sheet for a while, so so that, that can only help us with our confidence.